If you ever wished Kroger could deliver groceries right to your front door, your wish has been granted. Consumer reporter John Matteris is on your side with Kroger's first entry into the home delivery market. But first, why you shouldn't throw away those Eclipse glasses, John? Well, Kristen, I sure hope you haven't tossed those hard to find Eclipse glasses into a trash can this afternoon, because why? Because you're going to need them again in just seven years. You might want to tuck them in your nightstand or perhaps a top drawer in your desk, because in 2024, Cincinnati will be in the path of totality. That's right. It'll be even better during the next eclipse. April 8th, 2024 is the next total eclipse in North America. Meantime, in just two years, July 2019, a total eclipse will hit Chile and Argentina. Kroger is facing competition on all sides these days from Walmart, Aldi, and of course the 500 pound gorilla Amazon. So to fight back, Kroger's launching home delivery in the Cincinnati area. We are on your side with where you can find it and what it'll cost. Pam Stevenson loves Kroger's click list pickup system. For a $4 fee, a store employee grabs her groceries. All she has to do is pull up and pop her trunk. It's just so much quicker. <laughs> I'm in and out, and it's 10 minutes versus an hour. Kroger says shoppers like Pam have just one issue, no delivery. The one complaint we are hearing from customers is that they don't have anybody to help them unload the groceries when they get home. But that's changing, according to Kroger's Patty Leesman. The store is launching home delivery, starting with two Cincinnati stores, Sharonville and Cleves. You'll pay an $11 per order fee. But she says that includes the $4 click list charge. And there's no per item surcharge. Unlike Meyer, where you pay a small premium per item. So when you go online, you see what the sales are for that week in the store. That's the price you'll pay when you have them delivered to your home. When it comes to customer convenience, this is really the next step in a logical progression. First came self-scanning checkout, then came online ordering and pickup, and now comes home delivery. Kroger is partnering with the independent delivery service Grocery Runners that we profiled in a Not In Your Side report last year. You can order groceries online and then go pick them up curbside, which is wonderful, but it doesn't take it the final step. Now Kroger's finally taking that final step and shoppers like Pam can't wait. I'd probably try it at times, especially in bad weather. Have a great day. Now right now you have to live within eight miles of the Cleves or the Sharonville Kroger to get delivery, but they hope to roll out to more stores very soon. Finally, it's Cheap Gas Monday and wow, Ron McKitty and Bob Apke both tell me that Shell in Oxford is down to 197. Whew, I saw 205 personally at the UDF in Sharonville when it was up at Kroger there today and in Kentucky, Kermit Balmer spotted 223 at the UDF in Florence. You know, prices are falling back to early summer lows. That's great news as we head back to school so you don't waste your money, Kristen.